Good morning brothers and sisters, I'm full of joy this day to share God's word with you. Absolutely honored to join in study of scriptures and prayers. If you have any prayer request let us know and we pray together. Today you will be highly blessed by the teaching stay tuned. We appreciate you in God's love ladies and gentlemen. Today teaching is accepting others. Accepting is not the same as approving, condoning, or even tolerating bad behavior. Acceptance is an act of the heart in which we recognize that, despite someone's behavior, he or she has value in God's sight, and we honor that. But this can be a hard thing to do. There are many ways to communicate acceptance to people. One of them is to listen to them with patience and compassion and receive them with love in the name of God. Another is to refrain from mental condemnation and judgments, from constantly evaluating and analyzing, those things keep us from loving. We must take captive those thoughts of condemnation toward others, and submit to God. As we draw near to Him, we ask Him to love through us. Let's read Romans chapter 12, verse 10. It says, Be devoted to one another in brotherly love. Honor one another above yourselves. I encourage you brothers and sisters to live a lifestyle where we are kind with words use words like. Have I told you lately what a wonderful person you are? You don't know how much your visit meant to us. When you left, I felt as if the sun had stopped shining. Never forget how much your friends and family love and admire you. Dear friends listening to me, let us enter a new day where we put aside our defiances let acceptance, approval each other in God's love. Do we deny others? Let's read Proverbs chapter 16, verse 24. It says, Pleasant words are a honeycomb sweet to the soul and healing to the bones. My point is, look at the verse at the top, pleasant words, are sweet to the soul and healing to the bones. That's a lot of power, and it doesn't cost anything. Anybody can give words. Will you try it? Open your mouth and say the positive things you are thinking. Bless someone today. Use your words to bring healing and greatness in this generation and time God has given each of us. Desire to be remembered as the people who choose love, life and joy in God. We could all use some kind worlds be open to acceptance and approving of others in godly love. Thank you for joining me my name is Pastor George. For Sporty Flight Sanctuary. Our doors are open to you join together with us at Sporty Flight Sanctuary. And experience a positive growth in your life. Please dear brothers and sisters if you have any pressing issues in your life don't face it alone join with our prayer team speak out and reach out send us your prayer request our prayer team is standing with you in prayer. Every day. Say Amen. God increase you in his love. May favor locate you. New doors of greatness open for you. May God Almighty double your joy. Profits money and increase shall be your potion. I pray that God healing be on your body right now. Receive God's healing. Receive God's favor. I pray for those looking for job may God give you success. You shall be the top and God bless the work of your hands. I pray that your star shine bright you are a winner go out in victory. Amen. See you back soon. I love you all. God bless you and may God's love be reflected in you. Thank you for joining us. For Sporty Flight Sanctuary, our doors are open to you join together with us at Sporty Flight Sanctuary, and experience a positive growth in your life. Sporty Flight Sanctuary welcome you all.